Falls Lennox. Today is Tuesday, September 21, 2021. Kaylee, Tilly, and I are happy to share today's news with you. We are from Mr. Sailor's third grade class. Let's start by pledging allegiance to the flag of our great state. United States. United States, please stand, place your right hand over your heart, and let's we begin. To the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please return to your seats and heels tenderly to bring you more of today's news. Thank you, Ryan. Good morning, everyone. Rainy skies are expected today in Old Smith Falls, and the temperature will reach the high of 76 degrees. The cafeteria is getting a healthy lunch ready for you. If you are buying lunch, your choices are pizza bites or chicken patty. Now over to you, Kara. Thank you, Tenley. And now this week's copying good students and also perfect returns for the library. Today is Tuesday, September 21st. I hope everyone's having a great start to the week. Uh, we are going to read some copying good slips this morning. There are tons of yellow slips in the bins outside of the office, and I was going through them and reading some of them. Um, so I have selected some copying good slips to share with everyone. These are ways that students in our building have been safe, respectful, responsible, and kind um, in all parts of their school day. So let's go ahead and get started with third grade. In Mrs. Marsco's room, Chris was caught being good when he was responsible. He helped put away the book bins. Great job, Chris. Billy in Mrs. Malati's room, he was responsible when he uh, returned all of his library books. So great job, Billy. Sutton in Mrs. Tots's class was responsible when he picked up a water spill. So way to be helpful and a great, uh, great friend, great helper. Olive O in Mrs. Rivera's room, responsible, also being a great helper. So lots of good examples of students being kind. Alex Patrick in Mrs. Castraba's room uh, was responsible. Uh, let's see, Alex was responsible when he was a great role model at check-in time. He followed all directions quickly and quietly. Great job, Alex. All right, we have Hunter in Mrs. Burke's class. Hunter was responsible. And also Logan in Mrs. Burke's class was caught being responsible. And lastly, Kaylin in Mr. John Henry's class was responsible when he was following the rules in the hallway. So great job to our Copying Good winners. Congratulations. Um, keep showing that kind, responsible, uh, respectful behavior, um, being a good helper, being a good friend, um, and keep earning those Copying Good slips. Great job, students. All right, also speaking of responsibility, we have three classrooms that had perfect returns in the library last week. In first grade, Mrs. Rivera's class, congratulations. In second grade, Mrs. Wormoker's class. And in third grade, Mr. John Henry's class. So great job to those three classrooms for getting all of your books returned to the library. All right, just a couple reminders um, that when you are waiting in the lunch line, whether that's to buy breakfast or buy, buy lunch, that you should be at voice level one, which is talking quietly, almost in a whisper, and keeping your hands to yourself. Um, I know we've got lots of buyers and the line can be long, but it moves pretty quickly and we need everybody in the line to be safe. So please make sure that you're keeping hands to self, voice level one while you're waiting to move through the line. 
Um, also want to give a compliment to all of our students um, who are in the cafeteria and down in the gym at lunch, um, you know, for following the rules in the cafeteria and in the gym. So I hope that everybody has a great day today. Work hard, be kind to one another, have a wonderful Tuesday, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye. Remember, remember to always be your bulldog best for your chance to hear your name announced. That's our news for today. Have a terrific Tuesday, everyone. And, and let's go, folks!